What you mean you don't know? Hi guys and happy new year, happy Christmas. I hope everyone is having the best festive time with their families, best festive time. I thought it would be really nice. We did two Christmas day specials because we broke our day up into part one and part two because obviously it's really long and we vlogged the whole day and it was just super fun being able to share that with you guys. I thought it'd be really fun to do this video where I show you my favorite Christmas presents because actually I didn't get to show you guys that many uh, whilst we were filming the vlogmas of the day because of course we were concentrating on the boys because it is all about the boys on Christmas day. For everybody who's wondering what I got for Christmas, what was my favorite thing I got for Christmas I thought I'd show you in a little video like this let me know in the comments down below if you like these kinds of videos and what of course you want to see more of in 2019 from us I can't believe it's so soon 2019 is gonna be so soon so I'm gonna go through I've got like, just I've just got mounds of presents in front of me and it's really exciting because I haven't actually reopened any since Christmas day so it's gonna be for me it's gonna be like going through them all again which is really nice I haven't used any of them yet uh, I haven't used any of them yet no I don't think I have I've told a lie I have used one of them and uh, one of them is part of a set I got which is some of my favorite candles at the moment you might have heard me talk about them in previous videos but these candles this is the lime basil and mandarin so not actually a Christmas scent but these are beautiful. These are actually from Aldi, number one. This is the number one luxury fragrance candle. And I know that they had a huge amount of press last year because they said they were so similar to Jo Malone. Just in case any of you wondered, yes, I could get some Jo Malone. Here we go, Jo Malone candles. They, I am a big candle lover. I love lighting them before bed. I love lighting them when I go to bath. I love lighting them when I'm watching a movie in the evening. I think candles bring a room together, the smell, the lighting. I love love it but these Aldi candles I think I don't know if this is a Christmas present but I think they cost about four pounds they last for ages I have lit that one already but I did get a few of them this Christmas so going on to my next thing a lot of you might not know but I have I suffer from really quite bad insomnia and it comes in waves and I sometimes get it under control uh, with exercise etc but that is going to be something I'm focusing on in 2019 I'm going to be sharing with you sort of my journey and I might be doing that on my refelicity channel I haven't quite decided this is the big sleep company I have had a couple of products from these guys before which is from this works uh, this is an entire beautiful collection of the deep soak bath works this works um, a balm deep sleep pillow spray so I'm going to say without even reading the package I've got lavender and eucalyptus let's have a quick look lavender wild chamomile vetiverd I'm probably saying that wrong fast acting natural way to restore normal sleep I've actually had one of these sleep masks from them before but Finney loved it so much he nicked it from me but I love that and we're going to be traveling so much on planes etc this year that I will be using that a lot completely recommend it if anybody has trouble sleeping it's all natural next up is a Trish McAvoy there is a theme makeup and travel Trish McAvoy this is confidence to go you can see on the back it's going to be a little pouch and a makeup palette with brushes and we're going to be doing a lot of traveling in 2019 um so this is the palette here it's in this sort of beautiful elephant gray trimmed with the pink um excellent set of little makeup brushes and you guys know i'm all about doing my makeup quickly and efficiently being a single mom of two that's the palette here so highlighter blusher bronzer and some beautiful high colors and hello mirror <laughs> mirror mirror on the wall my family know me really well and they also know i do love gifts that will be practical in the year ahead going on to a not so practical gift um this is actually the first if i can oh i found the other one first of two this is dorchester a house of dorchester fine chocolate gin christmas chocolate tree so this is 
chocolate with gin and these are <laughs> gin truffles i really love that i love the fact that they know i i love a gin tonic i love a chocolate so why not combine them together i hope they taste nice haven't tasted them. These are really cute. I got some wireless headphones from Kath Kitson and they are in a really cute flower print. I think these came from my mum. I think they came from my mum. I think so. Whilst I'm on the travel theme, I got two really cute things, both from the boys, both in these cute little tins. One is pretty useful tools, uh, but they're pretty useful tools so we've got nail clippers nail file and a tweezers on a key ring really cute uh oh wait these are also pretty useful tools maybe they weren't doing the pun maybe it's just me but these are hair accessories let's have a look at the hair accessories I'm just opening the tin <gasps> oh and here we've got some Kirby grips, or do you call them bobby pins? We've got some of these. I really love these hair bubbles. All in a, all, what do you call these hair bubbles? I don't know. I love all those colors. And then some hair clips as well. Even though they come in these tins, actually for traveling, I'm gonna be taking them out of the tins, putting them on the keychain, for example, and just shoving them in the bag. I need to save space for the amount of traveling that we're going to be doing this year and obviously i'll be left probably carrying most of the boys bags on the sleep you can see my family know me so well i have got these spacemask.com interstellar relaxation and i am told so this is a box that came contains five pouches i am told that the self-heating eye mask um and transport me into another dimension oh hello i love that idea another dimension but i'm very excited i've never trusted these so i'll test these with you guys at some point and tell you how i feel about them any product that's going to help me sleep better i'm willing to give it a go i'm willing to give it a go next up this is one of my favorite brands of hair products this is show what is this this is the soya based natural wax scented candle so literally nothing to do with hair but i do love a candle <laughs> then we have two products which i presume are actually hair products from the show range can you see that there we are from the show range this is awesome this is the moisture conditioner and then we have the moisture shampoo I use everything from their mousse, I already have their shampoo and conditioner. I have a whole range of their products and I absolutely adore them so I'm very excited about that. This non-beauty product, which is quite exciting, it's got a name which I'm not going to lie about. Didn't impress me much because it's called a man tidy. I'm a woman and I still need all these things. The leather smell on this is beautiful uh, and it has got an entire, again, on the traveling theme, it's got a whole range of items that I'm going to need and tidies up really cutely into a nice leather package and I love that. I believe this is the range Harrison told me because he picked it all based around my Apple products so we've got stuff that will fit in with my new Mac, those are the connectors. Yeah, those are the connectors that I needed from the USB, um, except for my Mac doesn't have a USB with the new brand new Mac, but it's got that cord. I don't even know what you call that cord that actually goes into my new Mac, but with a USB end. We're going to be blogging on the go, making videos, doing daily content on the go. I'm really excited. They know how much I was kind of worried about that. This is the only item I got for Christmas. I might go in exchange, I might do it. This is uh, from June London and the boys knew I wanted some really comfy shoes to go traveling in that weren't quite trainers, new, a little bit stylish. <laughs> so, <laughs> so this is what they picked. <laughs> We couldn't get any more glitter. We already know it was Vinny, don't we, who picked this. He is our Niffler of the family. We have renamed him from his Magpie previous nickname. I really like the stars. They are really, really comfortable. First of all, I'm one of those people who kick their feet together as they walk. It's gonna get really scuffed with the white soles, and I think I want laces. 
otherwise I would keep them. I don't like returning gifts, especially that the boys have gift, uh, gifted me, because I just feel like they've, it's all about that, they've gifted me, they've gone out and chosen it, it's their decision and that means more to me really than how I feel. However, because this is quite a practical gift and something I do want to wear, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make that call. Cool. I'm gonna make that decision. The one thing you guys did see, if you've watched our Christmas Day part two vlog, the one thing you did see me ungift was this wonderful package from Harvey Nichols. And I have been lucky enough to get this twice, last Christmas and my birthday this year, where they put together these absolutely beautiful packages, beautiful packages that everybody can get, filled with goodies, filled with goodies. So I'm gonna, uh, I've just opened it. I haven't even gone through the entire thing, but it is packed full. So if you like beauty products like myself, and can I just say, I have used, I have gone through, used and tested out everything I've ever had before. I absolutely relish going into these. I've had this before. This is the Revita Lash advanced eyelash conditioner I, I i think this is beautiful product i love that we have a little bag from harvey nichols a little bag from harvey nichols on a drawstring i have been saving all these types of little bags that i've been getting because as i say going traveling oh so needed don't know if it's needed it's just gonna be cluttering up but everything is gonna be beautifully organized as we leave and then after a couple of days of traveling, it's all gonna go to hell. Look at all these face masks, I'm so excited. We've got a cherry gel lip mask, a cherry gel lip mask. We've got Huxley, the secret of the Sahara mask oil extract. Doesn't that just want to make you visit the desert? One One Skin, Harley Street, London. It was from Harley Street, London, and it says skin. Um, all over that, all over this. Flash Patch Restoring Night Eye Gels. Oh my goodness, I love that. Paris, New York, sample kit for a shampoo and conditioner. Oh, too exciting. Uh, a gift from Environ. Star Skin 7 in 1 Miracle Skin Pads. Oh, I love that idea. And of course, if I really like these, especially with the pads, you can take them to go traveling. Oh, one of my favorite brands at the moment the rodeal vc energizing face mask um you if you guys follow me in, on my instagram if you don't follow me on my instagram go down below uh, i'll put a link just there just make sure you're following me on instagram because a lot of the time i will try out these face masks and beauty products on my instagram stories um i tried out the b patches for the first time last month um by rodeal and love them love them in fact i have just seen them in the january sales not the january sales but the boxing day sales what do you call them january sales boxing day sales and i've ordered them online i'm so excited to get those from space nk um oh another star skin pads beautiful and then the last one is a 3d moisture infusion by sarah chapman london i am excited about these masks do you know how long I have wanted to try this next cream? I have been dying to. Who else has heard of the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream? I have been desperately, not only is the packaging just so delicious, I mean, it just could be a tub of ice cream, it could be sweeties, it's, oh, I just love it. And the smell, oh doesn't make me want to eat it any less I just I'm, I'm so excited if you guys want to please make sure to comment down below I might be testing out a lot of these products on my channel refelicity so let me know in the comments these if this works I am going to be getting a whole load this is I presume like a beauty blender but it's flat packed for traveling, I'm so excited if this works, if I can reuse this the entire time. This is from Blotterazzi. I am gonna be ecstatic. Let me know though, seriously, in the comments down below, if you wanna see me testing out these products on my Reflicity channel, probably doesn't go in sync with our half Anology, our family vlogging channel. But if you do wanna see more of this from me, let me know and I will post those videos. I'm so happy to review products like this. I am no expert, this is just, 
I've got quite sensitive skin and uh, I know what I like I'm of an age where there are certain things I need from my skin that you may not need from your skin for example like <laughs> fine lines and wrinkles okay I love this brand pixie um, vitamin makeup mist vitamin makeup mist so exciting I use in fact I can't believe it's not next to me on my bedside table but I use their toner um, on a daily basis so this is the pixie what is this utopia skincare eye serum oh I love an eye serum I GHD can they do uh, anything wrong probably not I use the GHD split end treatment on my hair every time I wash it which is not daily but I do use GHD products often what have we got here the Chlordali and I'm probably pronouncing some of these names wrong you know I'm not an expert but I like beauty products it's complexion correcting who doesn't want a correct complexion MGC Derma anti-aging night CDM stells and hydro no hydronolic serum hydronic if I show you that and then probably edit out what I've just said will make more sense I'm so excited oh, I mean I just love getting a beauty wall like this it makes me so excited and I'm so happy Harvey Nichols does this this oh I've had I've had their cucumber water spray before in one of these packs this is the botanical exfoliating scrub by Mario Baduscu I hope I'm saying that right I'm going out of picture to try and get that in focus there we are beautiful Lucia Magani and can I tell you I have so many I've tried out that eye cream I've tried out this is the refreshing energizer tonic I've tried out the facial wash before I love this brand look at I love the packaging I love the big box I love how much get of it VV cream gentle wash beauty wash for the V cleanse tone or refresh and this is the perfect fee never tried out this product but very excited to oh and look one of my favorite companies the volume mousse show show for the hair I mean also if you haven't seen some of their packaging before let's just open this up <laughs> let's hope that this packaging the bottle etc is like their regulars yes it is how beautiful is this packaging I love on my bath you guys might have seen in previous vlogs my bath with these products on the side it's also very glamorous the black and the gold and the sort of glass pivoted effect I don't know what you call that but I like it we got a purity made symbol oh philosophy who doesn't love the philosophy brand it is beautiful beautiful understated philosophy philosophy purity is natural this is the three-in-one cleanse for your face and eyes i'm quite red in the cheek today it's very warm in here i haven't got a window open and i haven't got <laughs> and i feel that the heating's on too high in the house oh i have tried lots of things from this company love this company i'm going to call these guys stry vectin don't know if that's the correct way of saying their name. Here we go, Strivectin. And this is the TL Advanced Tightening Face and Neck Cream. If you know me, this is actually my, if, if we're gonna be talking about body consciousness, my neck. You see me wearing a lot of polar necks. I'm not a massive fan of my neck. I keep my hair long at the moment. To, use it as a scarf <gasps> I'm I'm never gonna be able to say this name correctly Omoro Fixa Budapest don't know I got one of their facial oils in a pack last Christmas and have bought it ever since it is beautiful this is the deep cleansing mask though never tried that Ooh, that smell oh this company just gets the smells right this is can you see that beautiful clay type mask you just want to slather it on i'm so excited about that if you get a chance to buy one of the oils i love it the makeup fix makeup fix it's like makeup that's edible becca becca lipstick queen frog prince oh I love these little things. I don't wear a lot of lipstick. I've got really small lips. 
I've not had any lip fillers and it's just one of those things where I don't like to enhance the fact that I've got really small lips. And I know a lot of people were like, but you could wear lipstick to make your lips look bigger. It's like, can we just see this? It's green. Okay. Something's gonna be, lipstick frog prints. Hold on. Let's read this. Is it green and gonna make it a different color? <gasps> it does. It's green and it comes out this berry color. Love that. Dr. Dennis Gross Hydrocolic Marine Dew Eye Gel. I've used one of his toners before. Brilliant toners. Here is a Freestyler Working Hairspray by Oribi, or Orib, not quite sure, but love. Caviar Lime Acid Peel. I love the word caviar. <laughs> I know Aldi do a brand, don't they? The Aldi do a brand of caviar face which I've not tested up. I think I'd quite like to test it out to see if it's any good because it's really, really affordable. Peter Thompson Ross, what is this? Oh, a cucumber gel mask. I really like anything that's refreshing like cucumber. I follow these guys on Instagram. I've tagged them a couple of times when I've tested out their products on Instagram stories. They're really sweet and they have uh, light. I should say as well as, as, as these guys, the Rodeal Beauty guys have also liked when I've done stuff on Instagram, which I think is a brilliant mark that companies are actually looking at who's using their products, who's bothering to post on Instagram. They've liked stuff that I've done. I think that is really, really, sweet is probably a condescending word for that because they're a, a really brilliant beauty company. But these guys, I'm probably gonna say it wrong, but I'm gonna call it Sand and Sky. Um, I've used their pink clay mask before. This is their pink clay mask. I've used another one of their masks blinking brilliant australian pink clay pore uh pore fining face mask flipping love it how great is that when companies interact with you on instagram i'm not sponsored by them nothing obviously like that it's just a case of me posting i've tagged them in it and they have taken the time to go and like it or give me feedback or reply back to me and i really really appreciate that i think that's really sweet this is winky lux glazed lips how beautiful is that packaging 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 and look how cute this is this is like a glitter gloss i guess it's going over my frog lips mm. i like anything that comes in dinky little dinky little packaging dinky little bottles especially because of all the traveling we're going to be doing Last couple of things, another Winky Lux. This is a double matte whip. 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 Ooh, sounds good. But I like that colour. I like that colour a lot. Even though I don't like wearing lipstick that much, I think it brings out one of my self-confidence issues, which is the fact that I have got really small lips. And especially as the trend is like... <laughs> and I am like... And then lastly, I've got the Lunar Sleeping Night Oil by Sunday Riley. And I have used, I've used their water, water-based creams on my eyes, uh, on my face before. Really like that, really like this brand. I did get a couple more things that I'm not gonna show you right now, otherwise this video will become way too long. I got some really cute items of clothing as well picked out entirely by the boys although they often come and try things like when I'm trying things on in shops and I you know eventually go oh no I'm just gonna get this one thing because I can't spend too much money on myself and they've sort of gone back and gone she wants that and that and that and that <laughs> they're just awesome like that I, I'm just blessed with having two boys who are really on it in terms of what I actually want. They, you know, they also made me some homemade gifts, which I will show to you uh, because they're all in another room right now. And I'm just, I'm just so excited. I 
loved it and I know a lot of you uh, like knowing you know what other people got etc so this is what I got I'm really really excited by anything I didn't get anything weirdly I didn't get anything that technical other than my man kit and that's actually because last Christmas last birthday and the birthday before I got all technical stuff I just bought myself a new Mac I had just bought this new vlog camera so I think I always get technical stuff but I didn't need anything this Christmas so it was all completely things I probably wouldn't have spent money on myself you know extra makeup extra jewelry extra 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 let me know in the comments what was your favorite thing that I got this Christmas what was your favorite thing you got this Christmas I'd love to know I love finding out everything that everyone else does thank you guys so much for watching please make sure you've subscribed and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it that really means a lot also 2019 as I've said before I have really thought hard about my channel I do a lot of original comedy on TikTok and I have thought about just doing an original comedy video once a week on YouTube which will just be for YouTube I just don't know I don't know it's quite scary in a way I really love making the content for TikTok it's shorter whether or not I want to put myself out there on the big wide world web it's a little bit scary but I think it would be quite cool let me know what you think down below in the comments if you would like to see an original comedy video from me once a week on my reef list if you haven't already subscribed there go do that now because I definitely am going to be uploading whether it's just going to be reviews or me just chatting to you guys about being a single parent, being a mom, and away from the vlog, the kind of stuff that I might just talk to you guys about, not really involve my entire family in. Love you guys so much. I hope you're having a brilliant festive period. <laughs>